Oh hi, thanks for watching my video and welcome back to the life of Faye. Ex-popular, ex-privileged, spoilt brat who ended up getting herself knocked up and homeless. We lost Prada and we gained Pampers. So we're back to help guide stroppy teenager Faye through her sad, pathetic life. In the last episode, she was at high school, she found out she was pregnant, so she did a little bit of art on her little sketch pad. Would you believe this apartment was completely empty when we first moved in? Probably not, because it looks so glorious now. So yeah, this is our home, this is our baby, we did that. Uh, we had a girl, her name's Essie, and I have just had Faye polish off a few paintings. In fact, you know what, Faye? You're not doing anything. Make a figure painting, girl. I always get my artists to do figure paintings because A, they're worth more and B, there's more chance that you'll get a masterpiece. And she's almost at level seven of the creative skill or painting skill even. Once we get into masterpiece territory, Faye, we're gonna be laughing. Oh, we already have a painting right here. Let's sell it, 420, nothing to be scoffed at. In today's video, I expect probably Essie will become a toddler at some point. Right now, she's only one day old. Oh, feed the baby face, shut her up. Sell that painting here. Yeah, we're gonna get Essie to toddlerhood, and I'd like to try and make this place look even more like a home. You know, get some colour on the walls, maybe take care of the build and buy stuff, maybe get Faye a, a bed, you know, a nice double bed. That would be nice. In fact, you know what? We have a bit of money in the bank right now. Let's see what we can do right now with what we have. I'm thinking, let's start off. We'll just corner off, we'll square off the kitchen. Maybe pop a nice little archway in here. Yeah, that's lovely. And then that way we have our dedicated living room space, kitchen space, bedrooms. Okay, okay. So I think let's try and get some color in here, shall we? Let's put some wood down. Oh yeah, that is lovely, that is nice. Maybe a nice cream carpet for Faye. Little pink one for little Essie. Well, we can sell that kid bed, we don't need it right now. Get nice purple in the living room. And the kitchen. Oh, palm trees, palm trees help us forget how shit our life is. Give us a bit more of a tropical feel, eh? Maybe we'll go for a nice dark blue. In Faye's room, the baby can have some kind of baby wallpaper. Something like that, maybe. Yeah, that's nice. Tile up the bathroom. Oh my god, what a world of difference that makes, huh? World of difference. Okay, let's see if we can afford... I don't know, maybe some better doors? We'll just try and upgrade this house, you know, bit by bit. Just like that. Okay, now the baby is going to be a toddler at some point, and I, I'm not a parent myself, but I understand toddlers sometimes need baths. So probably we should get one of those right there. Okay, okay. Can we afford a bed? A double bed? Yeah, we can, just about. Oh, living the life of luxury right here. Alright, let's see if we can afford any toys for the little one. Little toy box. Perfect. Oh yeah, that's pretty much wiped us out now. Okay, but that's progress. That's some serious progress right there. This place is gonna look fabulous in no time. Oh, what's wrong, Faye? You need a shit? There you go, love. Don't say I don't do anything nice for you. Also, we cannot miss school today. We're still a C student and I wanted you to drop out before you even had this, babe. We were supposed to graduate early. Don't give me all this high maintenance shit now. God damn it, I shouldn't have given you that fucking trait. Shouldn't have given you the high maintenance trait. Oh, now you're very angry. Worst day ever. Oh, from high maintenance trait. Pain oh. in my fucking ass. I swear to God. Well, at least we're at painting level seven. So finish that painting. Have a quick meal. Grab yourself a sandwich. You have done your homework, haven't you? Yes. Okay, great. Oh, that football we got from Santa. We'll put that in the baby's room. You know, so that the baby feels loved. Get yourself a quick meal. Don't slam the fridge door. What's wrong with you? You need an attitudinal adjustment, like no teen I've ever seen before. Oh dear, the baby shat herself, Faye. She's not going to change her own nappy, is she? Let's just sell these paintings. Oh, almost 900 simoleons. Yes, we're back over a grand. I'm going to leave the kitchen till last. The kitchen is always the most expensive place to furnish. 
Oh, you playing keepy uppy? Well, I guess that that present didn't completely go to waste. Well, you've got what an hour and a half before school. We've got four days before we have to cheerlead, but you know what? We're on thin ice with the cheerleading team, so let's just practice on our cheer mat, shall we? I mean, we've got nothing else to fill this space, so just do it. Yeah, this place is going to look lovely once it's done. Have a sim do nothing social for 24 sim hours. Oh, what an achievement. You sad, sad life. All right, have fun at school. Good luck. Go to school. I know you don't like it. Right, and you know what? You're going to work hard as well. Congratulations on the new addition to the family, says the guy who got us pregnant. The cheek of it. Fuck you, Brock. Piece of shit. He didn't step up, did he? Thought he would prove me wrong, but no. Not even a knock on the door. Not even a present on the day she was born. Not even a Christmas card. Oh dear, she's very tired. Right, go straight to bed. Stroppy cow. I'll keep an eye on the baby. She's fine. Nope, she's crying. Sorry, got to get up. I think she's probably hungry. It's Essie's birthday. The time just flies by, doesn't it? Oh no, I'm not ready for a toddler. I'm not ready for the work that comes with a toddler. Just let her be a baby for a bit longer. React to first puberty changes. I think you may have already gone through puberty. I don't know if you've noticed, Faye, but you've got a baby. Right, go back to bed. I'll watch the babe. Babe's sleeping as well. Ah, mummy daughter sleeping. Oh, baby's awake. Up time for you. Didn't we do a painting? Oh, we did two. <gasps> oh, look at that money. Oh my goodness. Okay, right. Let's do some furnishing. I forgot we did those paintings. Right, okay. Okay. Now the living room is where you're supposed to feel most at home. So I'm going to prioritize the living room right now. We'll have a nice fireplace. That's right. Some lovely bright yellow curtains. Brighten the place up a bit. Maybe we'll fill this hole here with a little bookcase. Lovely. Perhaps we'll just get a nice little coffee table here. That'd be nice. See if we can get a bigger sofa. Something like that, maybe. Nice rug. Yeah. Little candle set there. I don't know. Maybe we'll see if we can get a little kid's activity table. You know, for when she's older. Just fits snugly right in there. Perfect. Well, I think you've got a lovely living room, Faye. What's that thought bubble all about? Oh, not wanting to give it a bottle. Oh, right, right. I thought it was like regretting having a baby. And then when you're done making the baby feel better, go and take a bubble bath. That might make you slightly less tense. Oh, the baby's still crying. Why? Oh, okay, fine. Dirty diaper. Fair enough. God, this is hard work. Just change the baby's nappy and go to bed. We haven't even done our homework yet, have we? No. Oh dear. If I had a bedroom like this, I'd feel like everyone was watching me. It's unnecessary, isn't it? This many windows for one room. Right, Faye, wake up. Baby's crying. Oh, at least it's Saturday. We don't have school. Yes, we don't have school today. Okay, go get yourself a sandwich. That baby's going to age up any minute now. Oh man, I had all that money and yet I didn't buy a toddler bed. Oh Carla, you stupid bitch. I'm gonna have to try and get Faye happy enough to make enough paintings to buy a toddler bed. Is that baby crying again? Oh, it just doesn't stop, does it? All right, all right, all right. Well, at least I don't have any other jobs I have to do today. I've got a day off so I can dedicate the day to painting, which means I should be able to make a lot of money today. I might even be able to make, I don't know, like five grand. I mean, dream big. Right, I've just queued up three figure paintings in a row. I need to keep an eye though on when my bills are coming. Not yet, okay, good, good. Oh wait, do I have bills? Bills are not due yet, okay, good, good. Great. Right, I'm gonna do five figure paintings and then I'm gonna sell them all at the same time. And then I'm going to be pleasantly surprised when they sell for like five grand. Oh, I can't afford to do five. <gasps> 4,902 simoleons. Oh my God. Right. Um, do some homework while the baby's quiet and you're happy enough. You don't need to leave the apartment to do homework. I know you want to get away from the baby, but you can't run away from responsibility all your life. Oh, this means I can finally afford a TV. I can't believe how much money we've got. I don't even know where to start. I mean, I suppose we could do the kids' room. That would be the right thing to do, you know, I guess. Put the kid first. 
Maybe we'll get in one of those little toy kitchen things. That's custom content, by the way. It's not in the game. Maybe this little bed here? Yeah? All right, I think that room is furnished enough for now. The baby's got everything she needs. I think we should try and work on mum's room a little bit. God, my game is being so laggy. Not sure if we can afford a computer, but we'll get a desk at least. Maybe we'll find a nice rug to go in the bedroom. Something like that, maybe. Probably we could do with a bathroom mirror, like that. I don't know, can we afford a TV? No, not a decent one. Okay, well then let's just get something... I don't know, maybe we'll replace the fridge. We'll get a good fridge to replace the shitty one. Maybe we'll get that fire alarm we always wanted. Okay, that will do for now. That's right, do your homework. Oh, this place is really coming together now, isn't it? It's going to look lovely by the time the little one ages up. In fact, I think... It's already past her birthday, so maybe we'll age her up when we finish our homework. Right, how are we doing with school? Once we've done our homework, maybe we'll do some extra credit work later so we can be an A student. We are almost where we need to be with cheer. We just need to get another fitness skill, so we'll practice our cheerleading. Yeah, and then we'll be on top form. Who'd have thought we would have achieved all of this? Still only a teenager. I'm proud of you, Faye. You really pulled your tampon out and got to work. Ah, uh, what should we make little Essie? A charmer or angelic? Oh, it's got to be angelic, hasn't it? Yeah, easy going, babe. I'm going to give Essie a little makeover. And then, Faye, you know what? You can do your extra credit work. Oh, toddler's had a makeover now. I even painted her little nails because I figured that's probably what Faye would do. What's wrong? Oh, you're tired. Okay, well... Essie, take yourself to bed. Mum's not going to do it. You're doing research and debate. You don't need to do that. You're an artist. Just do a figure painting. Have you done your extra credit work? No. Okay, do a figure painting and then do your extra credit work. How long do we have before we become a young adult? Four days. Okay. So we'll have a child before we're a young adult. When does she age up? Three days. Then you can do another painting and then maybe get some lunch. Oh, hello. You're awake. And you've woken up pissed off because you had a nightmare. Oh, dear. All right, let's just cancel out all that stuff and try and make the kid feel better. Brighten her day. I wonder if the kid has the sentiment of unwanted child. Oh, no, accepted child. Oh, good, good. Right, go and interact with your daughter and then you can have a lunch. Is the kid hungry? Oh, she's very hungry. Oh, shit. Okay. Right, well, we better get a high chair. And then we will give her some cereal. Who's that calling me up? Just hang up. Not interested. Right, the baby's hungry. Oh, she's not really doing too great all round, is she? Probably need to get a potty as well. We'll sit her on the toilet. We'll read a story to her for her fun. And then we'll just put her to bed. Right, let's read her a little story about Charlotte's pig. And then we'll put her to bed. Right, put Essie to bed. And then you can go take a shit. Okay, now before you say that you're not having enough fun and before you get too tired, let's do two figure paintings. Can you manage that? Just two? If I sell this one? <gasps> that one was worth a thousand simoleons. Oh my god, was that a masterpiece? Oh wow. Oh, good going, Faye. And then once you finish your painting, you can read something for a bit of fun because we still don't have a TV. And then you can go to bed. Right, how much were those two paintings worth? Is that it? Like 400 each? Oh. All right, well, we're hungry. The baby's going to get hungry soon. So why don't you have some food? Just check on the baby. Yeah, she is very hungry and in need of a lot of fun. So when you finish eating, we'll have to sit her in that high chair. You better hurry up and feed this baby. She's very hungry. It's in the red. Stop playing on your phone. God, teenagers. Okay, and seeing as you're in a semi-decent mood, how about another painting? You can paint while watching the baby eat. Okay, and then kid, why don't you just go play with your little kitchen set? And S and Faye, you can go and have a bath. Do we have enough to afford a TV now? Two and a half grand? I mean, that should be enough for a TV. Apparently not. Oh, damn. 
Is it too much to ask to have a plasma TV in this day and age? Oh, look, Essie's got a little chef hat on. Oh, okay, these paintings are worth a little bit more. Okay, okay. Now we're talking. Right, let's get a TV. We'll just get one of these wool ones. One of these little mountable ones. Perfect. Oh, wait. Couldn't I just get one of these and size it up? Oh, that looks a bit silly. We'll just get, we'll just get this one. And then maybe we'll get a nice little lamp to pop here. Maybe a nice little plant over here. Well, feathers, I guess. Get some clutter. We want to make the house look lived in. Maybe some cute little cards. Little pen pot, maybe. I don't know. What do people usually have in their homes? Maybe we'll get one of these cute little shelves for the kitchen. Little unit to go there. Yeah, that's nice. Maybe even a nice little armchair here. Still a bit bare on the walls. I feel like maybe we should do a few paintings just to hang up at home. But that'll do for now. Maybe we'll make a couple of paintings just to decorate the house. Maybe we'll do a medium classic painting. Brighten the place up a bit. How are we doing on our painting skill? Nearly level eight. Pretty good going. And then maybe we could do maybe two large paintings. Hey, level eight of the painting skill. I think we might max this skill out by the time this let's play is over. All right, let's pop these paintings up. So we've got this one. That one's a bit sad. <laughs> that one. And this one. I'm not really sure about that one. I think... Oh, it's a masterpiece. Right, fuck it. We're selling that one. We'll sell it and then you can make another one. One that's a little bit less depressing. Make another one. This time more cheerful. Why is Santa telling me he's in the mood for some retail therapy? God, get a life. You think I'm gonna be your friend after you gave me a football for Christmas? Think again. Did you just make the same fucking painting? Oh. Right, try again. Do one more cheerful. Stop making the same ugly painting over and over. I know you wanna have fun, and you can have fun when you get it right. Okay, what do we have now? Oh, much better, that's gorgeous. Night sky, lovely. Well, on that note, I'm gonna end this episode here. I think we've achieved a lot. The apartment's looking great. I think I'm just going to stick to a three-part series for this. So in the next series, we're going to completely finish furnishing our home. And little Essie here is going to grow into a child. And hopefully, we graduate early. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.